Kobe 6 Pro Tro Reverse Grinch. Man, these things are... Do you remember when we never thought that this sneaker would actually release? We thought it was a player exclusive and perhaps it was at the time, but these are going to officially release. Welcome to Sneaker Huddle Now. In today's video, we're going to be talking about in detailed review, we're going to be talking about sizing for the upcoming Nike Kobe 6 Pro Tro Reverse Grinch. Now, if you don't know, which most likely you do, let me grab something real quick. This right here is the original Kobe 6 Pro Tro Grinch and Kobe Bryant suited up in these. I think they were playing the Miami Heat way back in the day when I was a kid. And unfortunately, I think they did lose the game, but this has gone down as one of the most popular uh, Kobe sneakers of all time. And hence the Grinch colorway, he suited up in them on Christmas day. Obviously the NBA does have Christmas day games that they're very famous for, for some of the most uh, talented teams in the league. But the details of the snake print, AKA the Mamba print that we do get on the Kobe 6 Pro Tro and just the green, which kind of mimics the Mamba, the snake is why this sneaker has kind of went down in history as one of the best colorways and best designs of a Kobe sneaker of all time. Now, lucky enough in 2023, at the end of 2023, we're gonna get something that is the closest that we've ever gotten to the Grinch colorway. And it is of course the reverse Grinch. Now, when they did retro the Grinch colorway, uh, the original model did come with the red laces, but the second time around, they did opt to put the green laces or kind of yellow or, or lime green, whatever you want to refer to you know, that as. And that's how I prefer it, so I've, I've kept it that way. But they initially did come with red laces the first time that they released. Now, the first time that the reverse Grinch releases, they're gonna come with the lime green but this right here, my friends, the Kobe 6 Pro Tro Reverse Grinch is definitely the most anticipated basketball sneaker and Kobe sneaker of 2023. Now we will get more colorways moving into 2024, but with all that out of the way, let's go ahead and let's talk about this sneaker. Let's talk about how good it is and let's talk about sizing, comfort, all that good stuff. Now the Kobe 6 Pro Tro does come with a Nike Zoom unit in the heel that does provide excellent cushioning especially when you're on the basketball court and even for casual wear this is still a comfortable sneaker and big shout out to courtside nc that's where we picked up this pair of sneakers now inside the shoe we do get the same exact tech that we get on the kobe 6 pro tro grinch and we get the famous insole that kobe bryant was most famously known for saying that i want a shoe that molds to my foot we get that exact same insole that we got on the grinch except in reverse form now the traction pattern on the kobe 6 pro tro grinch is absolutely phenomenal especially if you're a basketball player this is one of the most popular sneakers for nba players and there's a Reason why now when you look at these two sneakers side by side they are literally a reverse of the other where we do get a slight contrast on the outsole we have a slight contrast to the midsole we have you know a same exact pattern our color pattern same pantone pattern on the top of the sneaker for the upper and then we do get contrast on the heel and as we you know pay close attention here we have that exact same contrast there uh, and then we have the same colorway pants on that carries on to the heel it is literally the reverse colorway and that even carries over to the tongues where the tongues are slightly different uh, colorway than what we actually get on the upper of the sneaker so there was a bit of thought that i think went into this i'm sure that they probably had a few prototypes where they tried to get it as close as a exact replica reverse uh, and from what I can tell, all the contrast details, the semi-translucent outsole that we get, uh, everything pretty much looks spot on. They look really, really good. The only difference in the two is that on the Kobe 6 Pro Tro Reverse Grinch, the upper here I'm, is probably mostly because of the red, this color of red, which is like a bright crimson uh, that we get on here. It is kind of somewhat reflective. I'm sure that, you know, as I rotate this, you'll be able to see kind of the glare. Uh, which it glares more so than what we get on the uh, green colorway, the, the original Grinch colorway. And while we're talking about the upper, we do of course get the classic black Nike swoosh on the outer and also the inner of the Nike Kobe 6 Pro Tro Reverse Grinch. Then moving to the tongue, we have a darker shade of red there, which in this colorway, I really love these green laces. I think even if it does come with a red set on release day, I think that most people are gonna be rocking these with green. But that red is contrast the green very nicely for the Kobe symbol that we get there on the tongue. And that exact same pants on a red carries on into the sock liner of the sneaker. 
And then topping it off on the heel, we have Kobe Bryant's famous signature there in lime green. Now, when it comes to sizing, the Kobe 6 Pro Show, these fit just like all Kobe 6s. If you've never had Kobe 6s in the past, they do fit true to size, but they are snug. They are made for a performance sneaker. They are a little bit tight. I rock my Kobe 6 Grinches for casual wear. So I went up half a size just to have a little bit of extra room. My basketball days are over, so I don't have to worry about, you know, wearing these, rocking these on court. If you are a hooper and you have a narrow foot or just an average foot, you know, width wise, would go true to size for the best performance as possible. If you do have a wider foot, you're a basketball player or a wider foot for casual wear, would definitely go up half a size. But overall, Nike absolutely killed this colorway. I think this is a colorway that's gonna go down in history as a really, really good colorway, mainly because it is the reverse Grinch colorway. And I'm super excited to see these actually released because when I saw Anthony Davis rocking these on a regular basis, I was low key jealous. So super excited to finally get my hands on this pair, but let us know down below in the comments, what do you think about the Kobe 6 Pro Show reverse Grinch? Is this gonna be a cop? Or a drop but uh if you love content like this we're always making videos like this here at sneaker auto we'd love to have you as part of the sneaker auto family be sure to subscribe but that pretty much sums it up for today's video on the review and on foot for the nike kobe 6 pro Cho reverse grinch these are going to be releasing on december 16th retail has been set at 180 bucks so uh that pretty much sums it up guys thank you so much for tuning in to another episode of sneaker huddle and we'll catch you in the very next video